Hello, and welcome to a brief tutorial on the use of the Spargo Capture mobile application. Spargo Capture is the fastest, easiest way to capture and qualify leads using your smartphone or tablet. In the next few minutes, we'll walk you through downloading, activating, and using Spargo Capture. Then we'll take you through some of the more advanced features and how to access your data during and after the show. To start, you will need to install the Spargo Capture mobile application if you haven't already. The application is available on both the Apple and Google App Stores, but the easiest way to find it is through the links in the confirmation email from registration at expoleads.net. Click on the link to either the Google Play or Apple Store to start the installation. This will take a few moments to complete. Once the application is installed, copy your activation code from the confirmation email. Open the Spargo Capture mobile app and paste your activation code in the activation field. Then, tap the Activate button and tap the click here to enter your profile button. Enter a nickname for your device that is unique to your scanning group. Finally, agree to the terms and conditions with the checkbox. Then, tap the click to finish button and you're ready to go. In our next chapter, we'll show you how to scan barcodes, view leads, and add qualifiers, notes, and survey questions. For your first scan, tap the Scan Badge button and allow the app to use the camera. Center the badge in the camera's view. A confirmation beep will sound and the lead will show up on your screen. Tap the current lead to see the lead details. After scanning, you can add qualifiers to your lead by tapping the qualifier icon and choosing the applicable qualifiers. Tap the back button to see your results. To add notes, tap the notes icon and type in your notes. Your notes are automatically saved as you type. Tap the survey icon to have your lead answer survey questions. We will cover how to add and edit survey questions in our next chapter. Let's go over adding qualifiers, adding survey questions, and editing a lead or manually adding a new lead. To add a qualifier from your lead view or lead detail screen, tap the qualifier icon. If you have not previously set up any qualifiers, you can add your first one here, then add additional qualifiers later using the add button. Once you've added your qualifier, it will be available for any lead you choose. Next, let's take a look at adding a simple survey question. Select the survey icon from the lead screen, and again, if you don't have any survey questions, you will be prompted to add your first one. In this example, let's get an idea of the company size of all of our prospects by adding a survey question to collect the data. There are three answer types to choose from. In this case, we only want a single selection question. Select a multiple selection question for answers, like various product interests and open comment for non-standard answer types. Once added, the survey question is available for any lead. These can be different for each survey question. You can also add a comment field to any survey question. When you tap the Save button, you will be prompted for the chart type for your post-show reports. Select bar, pie, or no chart at all. To view your charts and gain full access for managing qualifiers and surveys, please visit our web portal. You can find more details on this in our web portal video. Let's move on to editing a lead or manually adding one. To edit a lead, tap the Edit Lead button. You will see all of the lead details in editable fields. Scroll to the field you want to edit. Enter the information and tap the back button. To finish this chapter, let's quickly add a new lead manually by tapping the Add Lead icon at the top right of the screen. This is a way to enter a lead when there is no badge present, the barcode is failing, or you only have a business card from the lead. Enter the lead information as shown here. Fill it in the fields as you see fit and skip any fields you don't need. Once you've finished, save your new lead and a photo of the lead's business card if you'd like. Next, I'll show you how to access and email your leads for storage and later use. You can access your leads through the web portal using the link and credentials from your confirmation email. Find more information on this feature in our web portal video. Alternatively, to email the leads captured on your device, simply select email, enter the destination address, and click send. We hope you enjoy easier lead retrieval at your next event. Thanks for watching.